Hello brothers and sisters, uh, it's me again. I wasn't going to record a new video because everything I wanted to show and say I had already done. But uh, the Lord uh, judged otherwise. I have uh, ironclad proof that the method of astronomical decoding of a pet goat is 100% uh, correct. As are the dates uh, I have indicated. To make it uh, more interesting for you, uh, right now click on pause uh, on my video and follow the link below in the description um, to the music video. Do it and then uh, come back. Did you? Have you noticed something? Great, and now I will show you what I noticed. Let's go. No, it's not just a crowd of people in uh, idiotic costumes. Uh, in front of you is a starry sky, constellations on it. Let's uh, take a closer look. In front of us is a part of a starry sky. The singer shows the constellation Virgo. Bicycle wheels show the scales. This is the constellation of Libra. A scattering of garnets is a cluster of large stars in the constellation of Scorpio. Uh, this is how the constellation Sagittarius is uh, depicted. And uh, this is how he is shown in the clip. So we are shown uh, this part of the sky. Sagittarius, Scorpio, Libra and Virgo. Please uh, note uh, that uh, the tray at her feet is uh, either light or dark. Light, dark, light again. Uh, the thing is that uh, it depicts uh, the sun and uh, the moon when they are near. So uh, this is a uh, new moon. Let's see when there will be a new moon at the feet of uh, Virgo during the transition to Libra. It uh, will be on uh, November 4th, 2021. And uh, please uh, look at this moment. Mars and Mercury are down around the left leg of uh, the Virgin or Virgo. That uh, is exactly uh, what they showed to us. So once again, uh, this whole scene uh, shows uh, to us November 4th, 2021. Uh, what other constellations are shown in this clip? For example, uh, Opiucus. Do you recognize our old friend? No? And so? This is the constellation of Whale. This is uh, the constellation of uh, fishes. Aries. In uh, this scene uh, you can see the constellations of uh, Southern Fish, Virgo and uh, Libra.
next scene uh, Yorgo Libra Whale Pieces or Fishes and Aquarius. This scene uh, shows us uh, December 4th, 2021. Uh, this is total solar eclipse between Scorpio and Opiuchus. Mercury on the background of the Sun. Solar eclipse Scorpio Opiucus the Sun and uh, the Mercury together and uh, this is how it looks like uh, on the sky In uh, this scene uh, we can see April 30, 2022. A partial solar eclipse in the constellation of the whale. Solar eclipse, whale, pieces. And uh, important note uh, that uh, the actor which is uh, playing the constellation of Scorpio uh, simply hold an umbrella uh, not uh, being uh, at this moment the constellation this is how it looks like uh, on the sky the actress uh, that playing the role of uh, op Opiucus uh, in this scene is not a constellation at that moment, but uh, she simply brought a golden blanket, uh, blanket uh, and covers areas uh, with it. Uh, this uh, shows the moment when, uh, during a solar eclipse, the sun is uh, directly opposite uh, areas. The blanket uh, is sunlight. Uh, this situation on the sky map areas and sun. Uh, next uh, date uh, that is uh, showing on this uh, scene is uh, June twenty fourth, twenty twenty two. Uh, Mercury and Venus in Taurus. The creator of the clip uh, does not show Taurus, but uh, shows instead a box uh, that represents the constellation of Orion, which is uh, located uh, directly opposite Taurus. Uh, in this scene you can see Mercury, Venus and uh, the box that uh, represents uh, the constellation of Orion instead uh, the constellation of Taurus. Uh, this is how this situation is uh, look uh, look like uh, on the sky map you can see Venus Mercury Taurus Orion or Orion also you can see the horn why? Because uh, near the constellation of Orion, uh, you can see the constellation of Unicorn.
please uh, remember uh, this important uh, moment that uh, in this box uh, is uh, located Mercury and uh, Venus. A separate uh, plot uh, line in the clip is dedicated to Comet Leonard, which uh, I remind you uh, was discovered in early 2021 and the video was shot, uh, this music video was shot in uh, 2020. October 6, 2021, new moon in Virgo opposite the constellation of Ball that stands on Hydra. Constellation of Ball, Hydra, also you can see the constellation of Leo, constellation of Cancer, and uh, the comet Leonard. Uh, you can see Hydra, Ball, Cancer, Leo. Uh, why? He is, uh, why is he uh, applying an oxygen mask to a cancer? Because uh, the Hydra constellation looks like an oxygen mask with a hose that stretches to cancer. In this uh, scene uh, we see a comet uh, Leonard that has uh, risen high in the starry sky, in the area of the constellation Ursa Major. November uh, 29, 2021 20, The sun shines from Opiuchus. In this uh, scene uh, we can see a sharp fall of a comet from the high of the starry sky to Scorpio constellation. Uh, this is how it look, uh, looks like uh, on the sky map. Attention on the comet Leonard. Uh, January 2nd, uh, 2022, New Moon. The comet uh, Leonard, uh, if uh, saying imagery, has fallen and uh, will be attracted to Scorpio. On uh, January 3rd, uh, 2022, the com comet uh, will approach the maximum distance to the Sun. Mars is uh, between Opiuchus and uh, Scorpio. He is uh, gradually moving away from them. April 19, 2022 Mars running away from Scorpio and Libra. Mars, Scorpio, Libra. Comet Leonard in Sagittarius. Comet and Sagittarius. The tail of a snake from the constellation Opiuchus.
also Eagle constellation. Eagle. Aquarius constellation. Jupiter and Saturn. Two giants of our solar system. Aquarius, Jupiter, and Saturn. Uh, you can see how Aquarius showers uh, everyone with petals. These are aquariums, the average strength of the meteor shower takes place only from April 19 to May 28. In 2022 it uh, reached a maximum on the night of May 6 in the morning of the 7. Aquariums July 14, 2022 a comet uh, in the head of a scorpion. It starts shaking. Apparently it is beginning to collapse. September 10, 2022. The comet is already in the claws of the scorpion. She is uh, touching the wall. The comet either crashes into something or just explodes. It's finished. I remind you that in the pet god a flash in the sky occurred around October 25, 2022. Apparently, this is the explosion of this comet Leonard. November 9, 2022. Also, this is 11 9 or 9 11 in the European style. At this moment, uh, the Sun connects with Mercury in the constellation Libra below. Opposite Opiucus. Saturn and Jupiter diverge in different directions. The comet uh, splits into thousands of fiery pieces, which is what the suit shows us. This uh, situation on the sky map. Jupiter, Saturn, Sun and Mercury. Comet. She is uh, showing us uh, by her fingers uh, 9 and 11. Uh, it uh, means uh, the date 9-11 and also the second 9-11. Uh, and uh, the last date, uh, just like in the Pet God, November 23, 2022. New Moon in Scorpio. There you can see the Comet, Venus, Mercury, Sun, Moon. You can also see this situation on this uh, picture or in this scene. New Moon, Comet, Sun, 
Scorpio, Opiucus, Libra, and uh, remember I was asked you to memorize the presence of Venus and Mercury in the box. This is it. The same situation on these pictures. I want to say that uh, no one would have been able to fully decipher this uh, clip until early 2021 because uh, it was at this moment uh, that uh, comment uh, Leonard was just uh, discovered. Uh, brothers and sisters, uh, this is something. I have no words. Do you even understand what you saw? Everything came together. That's right. 100% fidelity to the astronomical interpretation of the pet god. This is amazing. Now we know for sure that the new 9-11 and larger events are waiting for us until November 23, 2022. Those who created the pet god saw the future or came from it themselves. No one will escape the apocalypse. No one.